If you see anyone selling designer eyeglasses on the street or the flea market, they might be stolen. Bandits broke into a fancy eyeglass shop and looted the place. News 13's Marissa Lucero has the video. Marissa? Dean, the alarm is going off as the two thieves ransack the place, and it never seems to phase them. And when they leave, they leave with bags and bags of expensive glasses. These guys are good. They're quick. And according to police, the two just don't care. They knew there was an alarm. They know there's video. Earlier this month, the two thieves were caught on camera breaking into Dr. Dennis Quijo's eye care business on Montgomery and San Pedro. The two spend a few minutes casing the area, then try breaking in using a crowbar. When that doesn't work, the crooks break down the door. They're gloved up, uh, you can't, so we can't get prints. We obviously want to identify them by their facial recognition when they come through the door. The entire time the two are inside, the female accomplice appears to walk with a hunch. She rifles through cabinets but doesn't find what she's looking for until she sees designer names. The man stays up front and with his hands already full, piles more glasses on top even pairs that belong to patients. Now this guy's at thousands of dollars worth of merchandise and the door that he's got to replace. It's kind of a mom and pop's local place, so we want to try and help him out, get him identified. Dr. Kehoe tells us the duo damaged expensive equipment and made off with nearly 40 pairs of glasses, and he's still going through rooms that didn't have cameras to see what's missing. Monday, another eye care business was hit. The thief shattered the glass door to get in, filled up with a bag of glasses, glasses that are in demand. They're going for those high dollar items that they can, smaller items that are valuable that they can sell real quick. So I wouldn't be surprised if this ends up down to the flea market or definitely online. Burglary detectives say they do check out websites like Craigslist and hit the flea markets to look for stolen items. Back to you, Dean. All right, Marissa, thank you. Dr. Kehoe says he plans to install a steel door and shatterproof windows to keep this from happening again.